Not sure you've scored on a slapper this season. Maybe you have, but uh, tell me about the shot coming near side and going up high on, on Roberto to, to get it. Uh, well, yeah, I mean, pretty lucky bounce off the end wall there, but um, I mean, just kind of saw it there, decided I should try and maybe take one of them, and um, lucky enough it happened. Jake, you're the most confident you've felt in your pro career, Mitch, right now, the stretch you're on? Um, maybe. I mean, uh, it's been fun. I mean, I think our team's been rolling. That's, that's the big thing. Um, I mean, I think our team has grown us in confidence, and that's important going uh, forward here. So um, I think uh, this team's feeling confident, so everyone in this room's feeling confident. You've always had the vision. How are you using more to your advantage now? Uh, I mean, trying to find open guys. I think, you know, kind of Pat and Naz, obviously, they played with me now for a little bit, so they kind of know what uh, I want to do, I think, on most plays. So, um, you know, they're doing a great job of just kind of reading off what I'm doing, and um, lucky enough, it's getting to them. Are you more comfortable hanging on to the puck, Mitch, like yeah. the play in the, the game of this period? Yeah, definitely. I mean, that was another great playoff Mo. Um, you know, he had the confidence there and held on to the puck, uh, didn't throw it away. And then, um, you know, I just kind of tried to read off what he was doing, kind of came over top, and uh, he made a great play. The game mattered more to, to them than to you guys in, in the grand scheme of things. They're fighting for a playoff spot. But what's it like to play against them and, and hold on in the third period? And uh, yeah, that's huge. I mean, uh, you know, that was a full push from them. Um, like you said, they're trying to get in the playoffs, and, uh, you know, that, they, uh, they played hard tonight. So uh, that was a big test for us. I thought we came out, we played, uh, played the way we wanted to, and uh, that's a big two points. Degree of admiration for JVR and the way he goes about scoring his goals from where he scores them. Yeah, um, I mean, he's, uh, he's unbelievable around that net. Um, you know, I get to see it firsthand, obviously, on the power play every day. So, um, you know, obviously, he played with them all last year. So he's, uh, he's always been great around that net. He, uh, he knows how to score. Um, you know, it's, uh, you don't want to leave him alone in front of the net. He'll uh, he'll make you pay for it, and you know he does every night. How high is your confidence right now? Uh, you know, personally. Yeah, no, it's it's high. Like I said, I mean, um, you know, feeling good about the game, obviously. Um, but saying that, it's, uh, obviously our team's feeling high on themselves too. So uh, when we keep winning like this, uh, I think it just builds everyone's confidence. Would be any personal satisfaction if you could reach 70 points? You're up to 67 now. Uh, I mean, not really. Um, just want to keep working, trying to, you know, just keep going forward here, get our team ready for playoffs. Um, I mean, uh, can't think about points. You just got to keep helping this team win. I uh, think uh, going forward, that's just the mindset in this room. Their top two lines play a lot of minutes. Uh, what made you guys effective against in your matchup with Barkov tonight? Uh, I think as a, as a unit, again, we, we got the puck in deep. We are playing well down in their zone. Um, I think when they did get their opportunities in our zone, I thought we played uh, pretty well inside. and. Didn't get a lot of chance, I think, around the net for a second opportunity. So um, saying that, I think at uh, the same time when we got in their zone, we were trying to make uh, you know, a hard on Luongo and trying to get his eyes away, and we did a pretty good job of it.